Okay, so second part here, let's keep going. Um, all right, so yeah, I had to clean up that line. I think the rest of these are good. So I'm gonna try this again. Oops. All right, that should be good. All I got to do is now tell it, close that out. There we go. Much better. Much better cheddar. All right, and then I'm going to go view that straight on. There we go. Now I got something I can plan my floor plan on. I can obviously use the pencil or the rectangle, two-point rectangle tool. I'm just going to rough this in for myself. I know I want like a main entrance over here. And I'm imagining my garage is right over here. Uh, and I haven't planned that out yet, so I'll do that later. But uh, I'll probably have a uh, entrance coming in from the garage. And then I'm going to say my, you know, I've asked you to sort of think along the time. So your, your doorways, right? And I know I want to have a main entrance here for my that front porch. So I'm gonna go ahead and just lay that out a little bit. And I'm just roughing this in right now. And then I'll probably want a door out here to this side deck for where I'll have, I, I've decided I want my kitchen based on the site that we've selected to be over here with lots of windows and lots of lights coming in. And then this will sort of be all the big great room where I'll have the open kitchen and floor plan for this master room. And then I'm gonna put a stairway up and down, probably in this area. So here we go, Kit kitchen, I'll probably have an island, so I'm just gonna go ahead and throw that in. Hey, you know. Um, and I'm thinking this area could be like utility and it would be nice to have like a little office area. So I may, uh, may throw like a little office back here and then we'll say entrance or attachment area for the, or doorway attachment for the garage. Stairs, all right, and then I do want a bathroom downstairs as well, so I will probably go for that right here. How about that in this corner? Oops. And now to actually make those interior walls, uh, I can do the move tool is a good tool, for example, to come in here and add that thickness or maybe faster yet, the offset tool. Yeah, that's a great tool for this. Yeah. All right, hit escape now, offset. Escape. There we go. 
Huh, that can't be pickable as a separate. I must have not created that right. Oh yeah, see that line didn't go all the way down. So I'm just gonna go ahead and delete it. Does, the bathroom doesn't actually need to be that big, by the way, probably. Oh, God. Okay, that's a little... There we go. Now I should be able to pick that. Do the offset tool. And this is where I could actually type in the four inch for the wall thickness. So um, I won't go through all the details, but I'll share this uh, progress as a exemplar in the assignment. But that's how I would proceed with this. I'm gonna have to make the cutouts for my doorways and I put that in the Google Classroom.